Good afternoon. Here are the answers to the math problems assigned this morning. Um, if you haven't done the pages 391, 392, go back and do the problems assigned, all the even problems, and, um, and then come see the answers to see how you did. Okay. Modeling real life, number 18, you have 324 beads, Newton, so you, have 324. Newton has 100 more than you. So Newton has 100 more. So the hundreds place more that goes up 424. Descartes has 10 fewer than Newton. Descartes 10 fewer, so the tens place fewer down four, and then goes down one four. Okay, how many beads does Descartes have? You have 325, 20, 324. Newton has 100 more than you. Descartes has 10 fewer than Newton, 414 beads. Okay, the next even problem. Compare these two numbers, 626, 725. I look at the biggest numbers first, the, the biggest place value first, the hundreds, then the tens, then the ones, six and seven. Well, I can stop because I know that six is less than seven. And no matter what these say, they're not going to make this any bigger, the six any bigger than the seven. It won't happen. So I know that my symbol opens up towards the 725, and I read it like this. 626 is less than 725. 22, 49 is something than 411. Well, I don't have any in the hundreds place, and this has four in the hundreds place. That's an easy one. All right, let's take a look here. 280 is something to 200 plus 10 plus 8. So we can do this. We don't need to put it together, but you can. This has 200. This side has 200. This size has 8 tens this side only has one ten so which one is bigger i stop here and i go toward the bigger one the opening toward the bigger one 280 is greater than 200 plus 10 plus 8. and if you added these together it would be 218. okay problem 26 683, that's my first prop, my first number, and 687. I need to know where this is compared to this number. So 683 is to the left of 687. So I know that that is less than. This one, 681, Oops, there it is, 681. And what's the other? Oh, 681. It's not on the left. It's not on the right. It's the exact same number. And when they're the exact same number, it's an equal sign. Write a number that makes the statement true. 324 is less than, all I have to do is make this number bigger, or this number bigger, or this number bigger. It doesn't matter. So. I'll start with my three hundreds and I'll say 400. Then I don't, it doesn't matter what I put for the other numbers, a zero and a zero. 324, because this has more hundreds, is greater than 324. So when I read it, 324 is less than 400. Next, uh, something is equal to 750. Okay, now the easy answer is 750. Could I also write 
700 plus 50 plus zero. Could I do that? Absolutely. This is the same as this. So either way, if you want to write it out in the expanded form, you could do that. And 34, what problem or what number might Descartes be thinking? My number is, here's our clue. My number is greater than 238 and less than 325. So my number, so here is his number. My number is greater than 238. And his number is less than um, his number is less than 325. So let's see which number fits in both of those spots. 300 is greater than 200, so that could work on the first problem. 200, 200. Okay, three or third, three tens, three tens. They're the same. Eight ones, eight ones. Uh oh, we need it to be greater than or less than, and. This is going to be equal to, so it won't be that number. Okay, uh, let's go to the next one. It's got to be greater than 238. Three hundreds and two hundreds, so it is greater than. Now let's look over here. It's got to be less than 325. Three hundreds, three hundreds. Two tens, two tens. Six ones, five ones, it's greater than. So this is greater than the 325 and we need it to be less than, that won't work. Let's look at this, 315, three hundreds, three hundreds. One set of 10, two sets of 10. So one is less than two the number he's thinking of is 315. All right. Hope that clears things up. Hope you did a great job and I will talk to you later.